Hey YouTube, uh, Hillbilly F100 here. Um, I guess you can consider this the uh, October update. Um, not really a whole lot went on with the old uh, blue truck uh, in the month of September, um, or at least not that you guys know about. Um, I've been doing a lot of stuff behind the scenes um, for that truck. Uh, what I mean by that is I've been trying to round, round up some tires for it. Um, been doing a lot of part searching and things like that, um, and a lot of planning. Um, you know, so that, that doesn't necessarily mean that it's out of sight, out of mind. Um, I do promise that um, anytime I work on that thing, um, I'm going to video it for you. So you know, you're you're not going to miss out on it, on anything. Um, but so I mean, I haven't I haven't been working on it or nothing. Um, but um, it's definitely not because it's you know I've, I've forgotten about it or anything. Got a couple other uh, irons on fire um, here in a little bit. Um, it's about nine o'clock now in the morning. Um, I'm gonna run out to uh, my backyard and pull the engine out of uh, that green truck, the uh, rat rod donor frame truck. Um, I'm basically, I've got a buyer for that thing, uh, for the engine and the transmission, so I'm going to pull it out this morning. Uh, I'm going to hopefully set up the video camera. I'm going to try, um, at the very least, I'm going to record it, you know, but um, I would really like to try and, and maybe do like a time-lapse video on it. Um, you know, I may not be able to. I, I don't know. It just depends on my editing capabilities. The programs I'm using are pretty old, and I'm limited on both my cameras and uh, my video editing. So that's something else too. I want to uh, make sure that in the coming months I, I get more, um, maybe some better uh, video recorders, um, and then you know go from there. Maybe better editing or whatever. I personally like the ease of uploading directly from um, the cameras, but you know sometimes you need titles and you need um, you know explanations on things and stuff. So um, for the month of uh, this month of October, I introduced a couple of uh, new things to y'all. Like for instance, the rat rod truck that I just mentioned. Um, you know I'm going to periodically touch on them and um, uh, revisit them. Um, until I have the ability to actually start working on them um, full on. Um, I, my main priority still is the F100, the 65. Um, and then once I get that on the road, which I, I do anticipate it to be, you know, soon, but once I get it on the road, uh, then I'll start parking it in the driveway and then I'll, um, you know, start my plans with the rat rod and then basically all I'm going to do is get that rat rod going and I'm probably just going to sell it. I may enjoy it for a few months or something like that and then just sell it outright to whatever for some extra cash. Um, I've got, we got 13 acres. Uh, that's what the horses, you briefly probably saw the uh, field uh, that the horses are on. Um, I'm, I'm in search of a tractor. Um, I don't have a whole lot of money to spend on it, so I'm going to um, try to uh, find a fixer-upper and um, kind of go from there. Basically, you know, something I could just kind of tinker with, and that, and that gives me another title or another option for some videos. Um, another um, thing that I introduced to you all was my pet snake. Um, I've actually had some pretty good feedback on that thing, uh, better than I thought I would. A lot of people don't like snakes, and I, I suspect that a lot of people who watch these type of videos don't like the snakes. Um, I was there with you. I mean, um, probably a year and a half, two years ago, I would have killed that thing. Um, and I'm not trying to be mean or anything. I'm, I'm being honest. Um, I learned a lot with my research and uh, got to like them. So, I'm not probably going to show any more videos of, of him eating necessarily. I might. It just depends. You know, I'm not all about, you know, promoting the, the that side of them just because if someone's got a negative perception of a snake already, then just showing him eating a poor little innocent mouse is not going to help 
a person's perception if that's what they already think of them. So I may, you know, I may show some pictures um, of or uh, some video, uh, you know, of, of me handling him um, just to show you all that he is it's crazy that I would even say this, but he's sweet. I mean, he, he's a nice snake. I mean, he's never bit or tried to bite or anything. Uh, but, you know, it's in their nature. So, I, you know, I can't be mad at him if, if he does latch on to me and, and mistake me for food or something. It's going to happen, um, and it, it could hurt, but it's not venomous, so it's not going to kill me. Um, and as far as pets go, man, he is the easiest one we have. I mean, we have little dog. We have dogs. have two dogs, two cats. Um, one of my daughters has a rabbit. We, of course, we got the six chickens, and we got the horses. Um, out of all of those, he's the easiest. So, you know, that, that says something. You know, these people that live in apartments, they, you know, they want dogs and they can't have dogs, this, that, and the other. Well, you know, get a snake if you if you can handle it. Because I'm telling you, they're easy. Uh, anyways, that's enough about that. Um, thank you all for, for watching, uh, those, those of you all who have watched this. Um, this is going to be a long-term thing for me. I mean, um, if you're looking for a channel, that you can subscribe to and um, know that I'll be around in a couple of years. Um, this is, I mean, as long as YouTube will have me, I'll be here. And as long as YouTube is, you know, here, um, I'll be here. And I don't think they're going away anytime soon. Um, I um, have one video that I was invited to be on the partnership program. That was the one of my daughter riding the barrel pattern when the horse fell. Um, if you look down in my videos, down over there, I think in the line, um, you'll see you'll see it. I think it's up to like 600 and something views, which is awesome. Um, now, granted, I'm not getting paid, you know, or not. It, it, the, the partnership program is not paid per view, or at least not the one that I'm on. I don't know how the other ones work. Um, I think it's paid per like ad click, but. Regardless, you know, go check out the video if you haven't. It. It's it's um kind of an exciting video and and um had a couple negative comments on that, which that's cool. I mean, everyone's entitled to their opinions. Um, but uh, yeah, so I mean, go check out that video. Um, if you're into equine, you know, care or whatever. I mean, I'm sure the ads that they I haven't. I haven't really monitored a lot of the ads. I know they have their horse-related ads, but if you're into horses, you may actually benefit from some of those ads. I, I don't know. Um, I'm not supposed to click on the the ads or the links because um, it's against the their policies. You know, because it'll be lying basically. I mean, you're clicking on your own ad, but uh, you know, who knows? Um, for all you guys that are, or people that are into horses, um, there may actually be some some beneficial ads. So but even if even not, I mean, I don't care about, you know, you click on the ads, go check out the video. It's a, it's a cool video. Um, that's really all I got. I don't want to be too long-winded, uh, but um, be on the lookout, like I said, for some more Rat Rod videos and, of course, the F100 updates. And um, that's about it. I'm going to try to um, try to post a video a week if I can. Um, I've been kind of hit and miss on that. So... We'll see. Um, Halloween is here. Halloween's actually tomorrow. Uh, my work every year they do a big dress up thing, and um, I just dressed up as a cowboy this year. I mean, it was, uh, it was not too far removed from what I normally dress up as, anyways. But it was something I could dress and wear almost my daily clothes, or at least my working out in the field kind of clothes. And um, they still considered it dressed up, so I was included, you know, in the activities or whatever but um it got me thinking about maybe doing like a really high-end um uh costume you know like a almost like a mechanical suit something uh that would really blow their mind so give me some feedback on that let me know you know what you think would be cool for like a suit you know like an iron man type suit obviously i'm not going to be that high tech or nothing like that but you know something that you know maybe two wheels um i, I don't know you know, I mean, just whatever. But, um, and also, as far as the rat rod is concerned, you know, I'm going to give, I, I really want to try to give as much, or give you guys as much uh, of a chance to give me feedback um, for the direction of this thing. 
Obviously, the budget is going to be real, real tight, but most rat rods, that's what they're about. But, you know, if, um, you know, when it comes down to the, you know, to the point of me getting uh, a grill uh, for that thing or a radiator, um, if you guys say, man, get a tractor grill or a tractor, you know, radiator support thing, then I'll look for one of those. If you guys say, no, go ahead and go with a more, you know, 40s or a 32 or something, then I'll go with an automotive style. Same with the engine. Um, you know, I'm going to leave it open to suggestions. You know, if you want me to run a small block Chevy, I'll run a small block Chevy. If you want me to run a Ford, I'll run a Ford. Um, but, I'll, you know, give me your input. Give me your suggestions. I'm going to try to get this. That way, you know, get you guys included into it, too. And throughout the build, if you have things that you want to see done to it, then I'll do it. Um, you know, obviously within reason. You know, I'm not going to... Uh, I, I want to still make it sellable, resellable, because that's the ultimate goal that I have is to enjoy it for a while and then resell it. But my hopes is, you know, hey, you know, if somebody um, contributes enough ideas and they uh, they feel that they have some ownership in it, and if the price is right, heck, they may even just buy it, you know. And I mean, they've seen me do all the work on it, so you know, they'll know. Well, you know, the quality of work is good. Um, so why not just go ahead and get it? Um, but, you know, regardless, I want you all to be a part of that. Um, so, yeah, I think that's all I've got for the month of October for the update. Um, I actually went through it straight through without any bloopers. Um, so I'm not going to have any bloopers on this one. Um, for those of you who enjoyed the bloopers on the last one, on the September update, sorry, I'm, I'm getting better at this talking on camera thing, I guess. Um, all right. Um, thanks for watching. Um, consider subscribing if you enjoy the videos. Uh, regardless, thanks for watching the videos. And be on the lookout for some others. All right. Thanks, guys. Bye.